Bangerang Rufio, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Lost Boys Gaming. We've got an update for you guys about the Nintendo Direct, which according to some inside sources is happening next week, the week of February 6th. So make sure you hit the subscribe button, like this video so you're kept up to date with everything going on here at Lost Boys Gaming. And let's dive right into it. Now last night, I believe, on the Nintendo Nintendogs podcast, one of my favorite podcasts, Jeff Grubb and Mike Minotti, they were talking about their expectations for Nintendo Direct and they were just point out or just point blank asked you know when do you think the Direct is going to happen and Jeff Grubb you know who's a very very good inside source I know he's gotten some things wrong recently however just the journalistic nature of his job I believe you know I've, I trust a lot of what he says more uh, than some of these things that you see like on 4chan obviously so uh, Jeff Grubb saying that all signs that he's heard and the people that he's talked to is indicating that it should be the week of February 6th. So next week, uh, typically, you know, you probably anticipate to see something on a Wednesday, usually maybe Thursday. So I expect sometime next week, you know, Monday or Tuesday to get an announcement. And then, you know, you get the 40 hour run up to the actual direct. Now there's been a couple other leaks as well, especially on the big one, especially comes from Reddit their uh, gaming leaks reddit uh, the mods even I mean, you know like with with this you know the mods posting something which they typically don't do unless they're pretty sure about it uh, they had posted something about a leak that they had received from someone indicating that you know this was expected to be on february 6th i believe which is in line with what jeff grubb's saying uh, but then they kind of kind of sense come back and made an edit to the post and taking it down saying that, you know, they did a little bit more digging on it after the fact and they're not quite sure. Um, but the, this one that doesn't quite hit as much as Jeff Grubb, you know, Jeff Grubb saying the week of the sixth, they were saying on the sixth, um, or the seventh, maybe I think is what they were saying. Um, and so just the way with how that lines up with the Nintendo investors meetings, and kind of historical nature of things. Like I said, usually it's on like a Wednesday or a Thursday. I just didn't quite add up, but they could be in line, you know, with maybe they have had enough of an inside source to just get the week right. Um, but ultimately, I would gravitate to more towards what Jeff Grubb is saying rather than uh, Reddit anyway. Um, but typically, like I said, if the mods are on this Reddit are posting, it's usually a good sign that they've vetted the information themselves. But like I said, you know, Jeff Grubb having the inside track uh, in the industry and kind of the reputation that he's got, uh, I would I would tend to lean more towards thinking sometime during that next next week that we should get an announcement uh, with, you know, not necessarily on the 7th as the Reddit page uh, has so indicated. So I have to keep our eyes out there. We are going to be seeing a ton of leaks here in the next couple of weeks, the next couple of days. So kind of keep your eyes posted for those you know a lot of these things are also going to be people just chasing clout so i always take I always take those with a grain of salt and if you see something you know that someone has posted that you know you're going to get six or seven first party games you know that's kind of a, a big tell uh but uh, you know it's also interesting to think of maybe we do get a lot more uh, just as we kind of think about this you know with especially with nintendo pulling out of e3 um ign reporting that it's possibly because or that they've confirmed i guess with some sources that this is because Nintendo has a light a second half of the year. So we know with Tears of the Kingdom coming out here in May and that they're probably expecting to be a front-loaded year for for Nintendo. Uh, so that could be a possibility that maybe we see, you know, uh, a Nintendo Direct that's kind of loaded up with games for this first part of the year. Uh, and then we, we don't get as much towards the end of the year as they probably are getting ready to launch Switch 2 would be my guess as to why you kind of maybe tone down the release schedule for the last part of this year as you're getting ready to you know market and hype up a, a new switch model and you're going to want some of those games you know some of these best in class third party first party games on your new system so rather than burning you know burning the candle at both ends of the year just kind of stop start it here and then you know start getting ready for that next console uh, sometime next year so i'll have to wait and see though what happens uh keep your eyes peeled like i said there's gonna be a ton of leaks and rumors popping up i'm sure for the next few days especially as we get closer to next week so i'm excited it's an exciting time of the year uh, nintendo directs are always fun uh, even the ones that are disappointing there's usually one or two games that are exciting and hopefully we'll get some news on tears of the kingdom here and 
I know I'm very excited for that and can't wait. So hope you guys enjoy this update. Let me know down in the comments what you guys are thinking, what you guys are excited for, hopefully to see. And if you think that, yeah, we can kind of count on what, what's being said here and that hopefully next week we have a direct uh, going for us. So hope you enjoyed and until next time, catch you later.